My songs aren't so beautiful. Mine are like, ah! That's not nice. true. You got. I already played her honey, though, which is like yeah. beautiful. Yeah. What about. Uh, what's remember. that one devastating. Um, That's the part I love when you do that. That's where, like, more people would get, like, totally, it's ugly, dude. My fingers are fucking ugly. <laughs> that's, that's true fucking commitment right there. <laughs> okay, where's the lyrics on that? I already can. Um, <laughs> Alright. A good move. Most of my songs are full blind because I produce and play drums on where your songs are just a piece of I had one called the ghost of the night. My house is haunted right now. Sweet. Well, you live in Mount Clemens. Good. That's a given. Nice I got some paranormal guys that'll come over. Alright. Actually, I'll probably get my house cleared out this week. Like, honestly, I don't even want to go home. Like, <laughs> so I had this idea one time because. I was sitting there and I was like, I don't feel alone in the room. And I wrote a song called Ghost of the Night. Okay? And I was like, what would soothe it? like this terrible soul that's possibly watching me? I was like, I want to write something soothing called Ghost of the Night. And this was my idea, right? So for when I release the TV at the Emerald Theater, I'm going to have like hundreds of candles lit around me. And it's going to be all dark in a place, but the whole stage will be lit up by candles. It'll be spiritual. It'll be, it'll be right. like it'll be something like that. And then um, I had this idea for just real quick on the inside of the CD cover. You know how like the booklet inside the CD can open up into like, a poster. Well, I'm gonna put a Ouija board in the poster and make the CD glow so that you can use the CD as the on the inside of the CD. That's a good idea. Harmful on the CD, but they'll have to buy another one. So. Mm -hmm. Looks like party got in there. I don't know, I need to buy some more. Um, I want, I'm getting a new one for right time, so I want to put them in there. I got a great deal. Friday at Meyer they have nine dollar uh, eight gig uh, radio show fifteen gig for sixteen ninety nine. And this is the greatest part about the. I, I like to tell stories about my songs. Um, really? Really? I know, but like. Uh, Justin you know Alexander. It's, 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 it's you're going to hear it on the CD anyways, but I, like, I want to tell you how, like, how it actually came about. So I was drinking some whiskey in my room and I was writing this song. I didn't feel like I was in there. I didn't feel like I was there alone. So I came up with this lyric. I was like. So I toast a few drinks to the ghost of the night. I pray like hell that everything be alright. You know what I'm saying though? Go back and do it. That's a great lyric though, yeah. Ghost of the night though, and my, th my thought was like, 
So I toast a few drinks to the ghost of the night. I pray like hell that everything will be alright. Uh, no, I mean. It'd be a great song for somebody to hear before they commit suicide. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm a, I am an artist. <laughs> You're not 28 yet. Yeah. Steal it. Oh my god, keep killing it.